Good Joe Lightsaber back again with another video, and of course, I'm talking about Wise Token again, alright? Um, I'm going to keep banging on about Wise because I really love the project, and I'm seeing massive potential with it. You know, if you haven't bought any Wise yet, what are you waiting for? I'll leave a referral link in the description for you so you can pick some of this up, alright? And, um, you know, we're looking at 30,114 Ethereum into this pre-sale already at the moment that's reserved wise okay people are trying to get the average price for that i want to show you guys the dashboard okay so you can see there's 4374 unique contributors at the moment that's a lot that's a lot so straight out the gate there's gonna be a lot of holders for wise all right very validated project and um in terms of the amount they've raised in ethereum already as well you know and coupled with the amount of wise that they're gonna put into the pool uh, the liquidity pool right we're looking at over 30 million dollars in liquidity um coming into wise and um, even just now yeah and, and you know there's still like 20 no not 27 days there's still what day are we on we're on the 7th of december so there's still uh my maths my maths okay it ends on the 31st of december right my brain is all over the place right now but it ends on the 31st of december so we've still got almost a whole month left before what's going on with this was it loading okay let's just click off that so you can see there's 4374 contributors there's still almost a month left okay uh for them to raise even more and more ethereum and i personally think a lot of people are going to be waiting until the end as well to get in but the disadvantage of that is that you may not get a good average price the earlier you get into you know something like this with the reservation days and stuff like that the better price you may get in the longer term so when it goes live on uniswap it's gonna be crazy all right so i was just watching a wise video as well and if i go back um he was kind of pointing out that uh let's have a look let's go back that he, they've actually uh, like even at today's amount of liquidity that they've got they're actually knocking link um, off the number nine spot so in terms of the top pairs in in terms of liquidity they will actually be coming in at number nine at the moment okay and they believe that they're going to be number one for the biggest liquidity provider on uniswap and that would even mean they were overtaking um uni themselves the uni token themselves at number six all right we've got ethereum at the top usdt at the second you got usd coin which a lot of people use that you know i um, I'll, I more use um, USDT, but a lot of people are using USD coin actually. Um, you've got Dai, uh, you've got HKMT. I don't actually know what that is to be honest. HKMT. Um, you've got Uni, and what's HKMT? Is that Hakuna Matata or something like that? You've got Core. All right, Core is actually quite quite well as well. Um, but it looks like they're going to be knocking a few of these off the top spot, especially if things keep going the way they're going. So imagine that it comes straight out the gate and it's the top liquidity provider on Uniswap. Just imagine what that's going to do for price, all right? So if, if I was you, you know, I would be um, investing into WISE and it's not financial advice, just my opinion. And that's just exactly what I'm doing. People are still asking me about pre-sales. Are there any good pre-sales? Things like that. For me, this is the number one pre-sale at the moment. Until something else can show me otherwise, wise and let's just go back wise is the top pre-sale for me at the moment and that's just my opinion guys at the end of the day um if there are any other good ones that you know about please let me know and i'll be happy to check them out if we go to the dashboard i am trying to get into the top cm referrers as well i've referred currently about 34 referrals 28 ethereum i still need to refer another 21.6 ethereum all right and obviously it's important for me to do that because i will earn you know 10 percent on whatever is referred i'm not doing all this hard work for nothing you know but at the same time i'm just want to let you guys know about wise yeah i mean historically on this channel i let you guys know what i'm doing and i don't see why i shouldn't do the same with this to be honest all right so if we go back to the dashboard you can see the critical mass referrers um my computer is giving me problems today it's not loading these things up um, well, I'm sure there's about 158 or 150 unique referrers that I saw um, earlier. Now it won't let me off. Okay. 
this is probably nothing to do with the website guys more so to do with my own computer all right let's just reload that and um yeah i want to get into this into this group here with the, the critical mass referrals group all right um there's currently 158 in there let's just leave that to load for a bit and come back to it there's currently 158 in there at the moment um since last time i checked all right and um 1354 unique referrals the critical mass referrals are those that have referred more than 50 okay and you can see there is a list here you've got one guy here he's got 2505 ethereum in <laughs> in his contract right 2505 ethereum is that what he's referred or is that how much he's got i'm not sure um i'm not sure but i want to assume that's how much he's referred and i have heard him talk about it on the wise channel uh there's another one here 1705 ethereum 1058 ethereum guys i've only referred 34 ethereum that's ridiculous isn't it but then again you know some people have bigger networks much bigger networks you know i mine's a very small niche you know but um you know quality over quantity sometimes isn't it but um you know I want to get into this group here, critical mass referrers, okay? And I only need to refer another 21 Ethereum to do that. All right, guys, so if you are planning to, to buy WISE, please use my referral link, and that will help me out as well. All right, um, let's just go back into here. I'm back and forth in these things, you know, I'm, I'm checking all the time. All right, guys, because there's literally only what? Uh, we're on the 7th today, 7, 14, 21, 28. Okay, so about three weeks, just over three weeks left before the wise contract ends, uh, before the pre-sale ends, sorry. And we and then, and then hopefully it'll go straight onto Uniswap. It's all written into the smart contract. Everything should be, uh, should be you know, legit, all right? But um, right about now, um, you know, I just want to let you guys know about wise. Yeah, um, I've been banging on about it for a few days or a few weeks. All right, and um, yeah, it's definitely the best pre-sale out there for me at the moment. Okay, um, we might as well move on to the next token, but yeah, I will leave the link in the description, of course, guys. And uh, yeah, help me out, and let's get let's get me into the uh, let's let's make me number one hundred and fifty-nine in that CM referral group. Okay, um, a quick look at Bydal. Okay. By Dow, we talked about it yesterday, right? We saw this double edged lightsaber or Darth Maul red lightsaber here, and um, you know, this this was the token burn, all right? The token burn came up with a negative impact once again for some odd, strange reason. But this is why I stress, you know, I, I was saying before, just because they're having a token burn and they're burning millions or billions of tokens doesn't necessarily mean that the price is going to go up, especially the further the price goes down. The more, uh, the, the more less likely it is that a, a token burn is going to cause this to shoot to the upside. All right. Even after that, we saw a small recovery. Okay, and then we saw an even bigger drop. Okay, but those dips are getting bought up. People are still buying by doubt, which is a good sign. You know, um, whether it's the same holders that are buying and topping up their bags, that's not really what you want. You want more people coming in, new money coming in, and topping up the market. Um, therefore, um, you know, bringing that demand in for the token, causing it to go up. Okay, but right about now, there are a lot of coins that are going down, and you know, sometimes it's just you know how the cookie crumbles at the end of the day. Wait for alt season, wait for a bull run, and hopefully, this will be one of the tokens that moves to the upside and people make a lot of money on buy down. Um, right about now, you got some people that would have bought over here and they just can't wait to get this back to break even so they can get out and run for the hills. All right, so um, yeah, if buy down gets anywhere up into these ranges, you're gonna see a lot of profit taking. There's gonna be a lot of resistance up there as well. So um, I really do hope that there is uh, uh, um, that there is an alt season, of course we all do, but I really do hope that there's an alt uh, that buy down has its place in the alt season, and you know we can see some positive, some positives coming out of this chart pattern. Okay, um, it does look like it does still look like it is leveling out a bit. At the end of the day, it's not just falling to the wayside um, like it used to be. It looks like it found a bottom over here. Um, I would be deeply concerned if it did kind of come back underneath this level. I'll be I'll be honest with you. All right, we will have to wait and see how that plays out. 
okay? Bubble Network, obviously, guys, you know, I want to talk to you a little bit. Uh, let you guys know that um, we are ramping up marketing, all right? So we've got a few things in the works, a few articles. Sometimes you can reach out to YouTubers and, you know, they don't always respond to you, right? They don't really have the infrastructure like some of these mainstream media outlets have where, you know, there's people that are put in place to answer those things. You know, some people, they pick and choose what they want to respond to and stuff like that. But, you know, um, I'm just thinking, why not look at, you know, different outlets, you know, is a more professional outlets that are going to attract even more of a wider variety of people, a wider crowd. You know, if you look at like the top uh, YouTubers like Big Boy, for example, and Crypto Love, I mean, these guys, they have, you know, in excess of 150,000 subscribers. You know, how many of those are unique subscribers that are, you know, tuning into the videos regularly? very small percentage of that as well okay if you look at the average view time or, or the average amount of views on videos even with these larger sorts of channels you know you're not probably not going to see within a month more than thirty thousand views on any single video right and you know that's not going to bring genuine you know more than thirty thousand genuine investors even to any one project okay because a lot of people they they watch it or they click on it they click off you know they want to know what's going on and, you know, there's a lot of reasons why um, it's better sometimes to look at um, other alternatives because YouTube, uh, YouTuber videos can make a token move. They can. Well, it, don't, it won't, doesn't necessarily mean it's got to happen. But um, a lot of the time, those are short-term moves um, which cause the price to, to go up. Now, yes, granted, it does raise awareness, yeah, but um, short-term moves, people take the profit, Go do another video about another token the next day. They're out of that one and they're into that one, okay? Into the new token. So, you know, we want genuine investors, people that are, you know, long term holders, people that are reading, you know. So, I'm looking at articles, right? I'm looking at um, doing, I mean, when I say I'm looking at, I've already sealed deals, right? So, this month we should see something at least coming out, all right, guys? And um, people are talking about staking farming you know it's all happening this month yeah december should be a good month for bubble network and that's if people get behind it that's if people support little old me you know um people are quite happy to support you know some of these other guys that they don't really have that sense of person personal kind of um interaction with you know i'm the type of person you know you message me um you know i'm more than likely going to message you back um, if i get around to it when i get around to it well, guys, people message me on Twitter, they message me on Telegram, they message me on the YouTube channel. A lot of the time, I do find the time to get back to these people. And, um, you know, that's just me. You know, guys, I'm, I'm an interactive type of person and I do care about you guys. Um, I can, I'll help anyone that I can help if I can help them. But, um, you know, every now and again, you get people asking silly questions that they could just go and read somewhere or they could just, you know, I, I, I don't really answer everything nowadays. Um, in the beginning, I did, you know, but um, time is valuable, guys, sometimes, you know. And yeah, I mean, if you're in this game, you know, we're always saying do your own research, do your own research. Doing your own research doesn't necessarily mean ask a YouTuber, okay? Sometimes you got to read, you got to look, you got to find out, guys. But um, yeah, Bubble Network, we are pushing, we are still trying to get things done. No, I am not a massive project with millions and billions of dollars worth of budget like XRP or something like that. Little old me trying to do a little something, you know, and hopefully it will go somewhere. I believe it will go somewhere, otherwise I won't waste my time on it. All right, guys, and I do appreciate every subscriber. I appreciate every investor in Bubble Network. I appreciate all of you guys, and um, I'm doing this for you as well. All right, guys, I don't want to let people down. I don't want to let myself down, you know. I've got self-confidence. I've got the drive for it, and um, I'm, I'm trying, guys, I'm doing my best, um, people are going to sell, people are going to take profit sometimes, I mean, it's only been uh, seven days in December now, some people are really impatient, you know, um, everyone wants a quick buck nowadays, especially newbies coming into crypto, not everyone has that holding power, that staying power, not everyone has that uh, understanding um, uh, of something different, something new, um, not everybody has that. Right, not everybody has that sense of community so you know i do appreciate all of you guys getting behind me the comments in the telegram group are great some of you guys are just great you know i could shout some of you guys out but i don't want to single anyone out uh, or i don't want to leave anyone out 
but some of you guys in the group are great and uh, you know I, I do read the comments and stuff like that and I try to respond sometimes and you know guys just keep it coming the telegram group is growing and um, I really do really really appreciate every single one of you but that is about it for now if you're not subscribed to the channel make sure you subscribe like and comment remember I do have a link in the description for wise token all right guys so let's help each other out with this I'm helping you out by letting you know about wise and if you're not in this I really believe personally believe that this is gonna go up very high being somebody who has experience in bringing a cryptocurrency to market I know how to get the price I know how to promise 2x I make 2x I know how to promise 3 4 5x you know with the help of my developer of course and make it happen right I know how to do that now yeah I didn't before but I have experience in that so when I look at something like wise with over 17 almost 18 million in a contract already right uh, or, or raised in pre-sale that at least minimum 90 percent of that's going to go to it Plus, they're going to have to put Wise Token in for liquidity in order for people to execute their sales, right? And and execute execute their buy orders, right? Mate, I mean, I think that this price is going to just be astronomical, yeah. And, and we've seen it with we've seen it with other tokens, right? We've seen it with there was one called Catalo, right? We just saw that the liquidity got added yesterday, just went absolutely crazy. Let's just uh, show you guys, and the price hasn't come back down off that either, you know. Um, still, you know, uh, let's just quickly show you Catalo, um, if it's the right one, because there's a few fakes on here. I need to make sure I find the right one first time. Okay, but yeah, it's trending there at number four. A few decent coins here. We talked about base. RFI is another one. I may do a video on. I really like that as well. Uh, some of these are up very high, but Catalo, you can see. Um, this was like it, it came out. I mean, the pre sale sold out in like a couple of seconds, as far as I'm aware. Um, somebody let me know yesterday, but you see, they it come on, they didn't add the liquidity straight away, or I'm not sure they did. Uh, whether that was, I don't think that was new money coming into the market. This was liquidity, right? As soon as they did, it took the price straight. Let's see, let's see how far that went up because people were asking, was this like some kind of glitch? It wasn't a glitch, right? We are looking at 31,000%. Taylor, right and it hasn't just fallen to the wayside it's trending sideways okay that is crazy all right guys from underneath from 0.000 0.000 one of a penny right or whatever that is right all the way up yesterday to 39 cents pulled back to 19 cents either way you would have made money on this especially if you got in the pre-sale right I'm thinking that for wise token, all right? So, you know, I could be wrong at the end of the day, this is crypto, but at the same time, I really don't think I am.